Right now, we're going to be shifting focus because in a major crackdown on fraudulent betting and loan apps, the center has now taken a stern step. They are hunting down on advertising of fraudulent loan apps that many platforms are promoting. The advisory also states that all intermediaries or platforms should take additional measures to not allow any advertisements of illegal loan and betting apps having potential, having, which have the potential to scam and mislead the users. Now, this comes after the Ministry of Electronics and Information Technology issued an advisory to intermediaries, including Meta and Google, instructing them to take down misinformation and deep fakes. Now, the advisory also stated that the government has also directed social media and other platforms to ensure that they do not host advertisements of fraudulent loan apps. Now, we're crossing over to my colleague Sabia Sachi to get us more on this. Uh, Sabia Sachi, can you tell us more about what's been stated in the advisory? What are the specific details which are coming to light? Well, absolutely. See, the ministry has asked the tech companies in India to block advertisements uh, promoting illegal loan and betting applications. And this particular advisory that was issued by the government alliance with the Reserve Bank of India's uh, earlier direction on curbing such uh, fraudulent apps. And uh, the government has said that the platform should take additional measures to not permit any advertisement of illegal loan and betting apps having potential to scam and mislead users and the consequences of which will be the sole responsibility of the platforms. And the crackdown comes as part of India's effort to clamp down on the uh, proliferation of the fraudulent uh, uh, instant loan apps and protect users' personal data from uh, misuse. And uh, the advisory focuses on the need for platforms to uh, issue clear instructions to users, warning them against deepfake content as well as the legal conse consequences of using or creating such content. Uh, we have seen that uh, in the month of November, uh, in uh, consecutive two days, there was high-level meeting that was going on first with uh, Ashwini Vaishnav, then with Rajiv Chandrasekhar, where all the platforms and the representatives were present here in the national capital. And these all advisory were issued by the government after meeting with all the social media platforms. All right, Savisachi, thank you so much for joining us and bringing us those details.